Even microphone is there. No, no, but the voice is so good. <coughs> Tomorrow. Maybe. Maybe. Because April, now next month will be May. May. <laughs> <laughs> Then Monyuti can speak something. Monyuti is thinking that here the main administrator of Angela Merkel. I am same category, same family, but mother mind asking me, so I am giving chance first to you. Speak something. Close your eyes, you could not see anyone. <laughs> when Lord Ram broke the big bow of Sivji, it's so tremendous sound. Lakshman, Lord Ram is there, and Parasurama is in Mahindra Parvat, mountain Mahindra. They ran there. Okay. Who is the culprit? Break the bow of Sivji, my guru. I'll kill him. Then Hon Lakshmanji said, What happened? Why so angry? He told, Who break the this bow? <laughs> Lakshman told, What happened? Why you was angry? <coughs> well, in our dynasty, we always protect Brahmin. In one hand, you were dressed like Chhatriya, you have axe and bow. Other than he dressed like Brahmin, other is I can kill you. What? Small boy and challenging me? Lakshman told, oh, when I was, we were young, we broke in so many bows. Nobody became angry. Why so much attached with this old and torn bow? What happened? At that time, no one angry. For example, do you think? Bow of Sibji and your Dhanu is small boy same. But for you maybe not same. We are Chhatriya boy. So everything same for us. This is our duty. This is our business to play with bow and arrow. Person become more angry. He tell Ram, take it away from him. Take this away from here. I don't want to see him. 
Lakshman to, oh Prabhu, please close your eyes, then I will not think you will see me. <laughs> it's the easy answer. In the same way, you know, how I can speak in front of others, so you can close your eyes, like Umadi used to speak, then you can speak, you could not see anyone. <laughs> Manjadi will speak, I give formula how to speak. <laughs> But her English is not so. You can speak in German. You can speak German, no problem. Okay, don't worry. We are only denied. Guranga had first chance. Now, then, can I probably speak something? Then I'll speak. Om Gyan Tvyanisya Gyanam Nintana Sarakaya Chakso Niritam Nena Tasmai Sivi Kuvade Manisha Kaipa Tavodesa Kipa Sintopya Ivatam Patita Nam Pavane Pyo Vaishnavi Pyo Nam Bho Namaha Yesterday we have heard about the glory of Sadhu Sangha from Sriman Bratana Prabhu. He um, explained how it is essential that uh, we should um, must take the uh, association of very advanced devotees, so this will help us in our spiritual life. So, in the uh, Navatri Dharma Hatmya by Shiva Bhakti Vinotaku, Bhakti Vinotaku, he, um, he explains how Nitya Jiva Goswami, he asked Nityananda Prabhu one question. He says, then you have explained this Navatri Dharma, it is so merciful, anyone who comes here even he spends one night, it is li like living hundreds of year, hundred years in all holy cities. <coughs> Anyone walking in with Anarati Dham, he will uh, conquer birth and death. Very wonderful uh, um, power to give bhakti, this holy Dham. So how is, how is it that not everyone there in Anarati has bhakti? because they are spending many nights there, so they should all have pure bhakti. Then Sri Nityananda Prabhu, uh, then it, also Jiva Goswami is saying, and uh, so many people we see, they don't have bhakti. So if we come there to Sri Navati Dham, then uh, why should we get bhakti then? Yeah. If so many don't have, then how? I can expect that this result will be there for me. Then Sri Nityananda Prabhu, he is answering, this is, uh, this is certainly right. If it is said in Shastra that this Navadvi Dham it is so much powerful, then this is true. But the question is, is this person or the, who is coming to Navadvi, is he really a Navadvi or is he not really there? Because the Holy Dham it is covered, by one net of Maya, one, like one covering of Maya. And those, Nityananda Prabhu says, those who don't have any um, relationship, Sambandha with Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, then they are not in the Holy Dham. Really. They are on, only on this net of Maya. They are not in the Holy Dham. So, and therefore, they are seeing only ma Maya, material things. They are not seeing the, the Holy Dharma, and also they don't have all, all the benefit of being in the Holy Dharma. So then how is it possible to get this relationship with uh, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu? And then Nityananda Prabhu, he said there's only uh, one way how to get this relationship with Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, and this is by the mercy of Sadhu, by Sadhu Sangha. Yes. Because the Sadhus, they are, have relationship with Mahaprabhu, they are in his family. Yeah, and uh, by their mercy, then uh, we can also get this relationship with Mahaprabhu. What is our relationship with Mahaprabhu? 
that he is our master and we are his servants. Yeah. And then by this, um, we become the servant of Mahaprabhu, and by his mercy we will attain uh, entrance to the pastimes, to Prindavan, to the pastimes of Sri Radha Krishna. So in this way we, we can see that uh, how without the uh, mercy of Sadhu, without Sadhu Sangha, even they may come to Navati Dham, but we will not be in Navati Dham. Yeah. Also, uh, uh, it is said, Sitanya Mahaprabhu has said that there are five uh, Angas, <coughs> main um, kinds of bhakti. Only one little bit of this um, five kinds, practicing these five kinds of bhakti, then Bhava Bhakti or love for Krishna will uh, arise in the heart. And these five are um, Satu Sangha, then Krishna Kirtan, Bhagavad Shravan, listening to Srimad Bhagavatam, then the worship of the Muti, of um, Deity, and also uh, residing on holy place. So these five kinds of bhakti, they're very, very powerful. And only little contact can give already love for Krishna. But it is said all these kind, five kinds of bhaktis, they have to be practiced in the association of sadhus. Yeah. If we chant the holy name, but not uh, in sadhu sangha, not under the guidance of Guru and Vaishnava, then we can chant for thousands and thousands of lifetimes, and, but we will not make any advancement. Mm. One time I had one, a new one devotee, he did not have any guru, any sadhu sangha. And he was uh, trying to chant without sadhu sangha. He was painting all the walls of his flat, he was painting everything Maha Mantra. <laughs> uh, and he was chanting like, uh, like uh, anything. But uh, you know, he did not chant for very long. And what he is doing now, then I don't know. Well, he is not in bhakti anymore. Mm -hmm. So also listening Srimad Bhagavatam, not in association of the devotees, will not give any fruit. But it is said, if you listen in Sadhu Sangha, Satang Pasangan, Mamadiya Sammito, Bhavanti Ritkana Rasayana Tata, Tatsoshanat Ashwa Bhavagavatmani, Shrata, Ratiya, Bhaktiya, Anukramishati. If we listen about the sweet pastimes of Krishna, Sriman Bhaktam, from the mouth of Sadhu, it is very, um, makes the heart very satisfied. We will become very happy. And automatically, first, Shraddha, faith, will come in our heart. Then, Bhava Bhakti, uh, or um, attachment and affection for Krishna will our come come in our heart, and finally Prema Bhakti will come into our heart. But if we don't listen in association of Sadhu, Sriman Bhagavatam, then only <coughs> it can be very dangerous and very harmful. And we can go to hell very nicely also, if we take this pastimes of Krishna to be some material affairs. Also worshipping the deity, and living in holy dham, everything has to be done in the association of sadhus. So therefore, Srila Gurudev, this was one of his main um, points he was always doing, always saying and advising that we should take care to always be in sadhu sangha. And like Maharaj has just said yesterday, we always have to wind up our watches. Without, without regularly having Sadhu Sangha, then just Maya is very, very powerful, especially in this Kali Yuga. Then we will not be able to continue very long with our practice. And then this is very unfortunate, because then this rare chance to come in Mahaprabhu's line, being in contact with our Gurudev, we can miss this rare chance in this life. Uh, and we can spend our life with something else, but not with bhakti. So, therefore, we pray to Gurudev and Krishna that we always may have the association of 
sadhus, so that our um, um, we always can remain strong and fixed on this bhakti path. No, Tom can come here. Don't fear. Go around the forest. In our mother, one boy looked like same as it is face cut in everything, so I remember that boy. And Krishna was all there, one boy was like him, another Tom. He was very naughty. <laughs> he was always making jokes eh, with the devotees and then... Uh, Not a joke. <laughs> and what did uh, Prem Balava ask Gurudev? Oh. There are six, seven boys in Mathura. So... Gurudev told that from small age they come in Mathura, so yeah. they're like very naughty. They're very naughty. Yeah. And during Brajamandal Parikrama, I have to sleep with them because they're not controlled by others. Gurudev bed we make little higher and I have to sleep, I have to sleep under bed with them. This side three boys, another side three boys. And they know if they make any sound, Gurudev beat them. So they'll, they'll tickling me, pinch me. Yeah. If I sound, make sound, that Guru will chastise me. So follow the always. Every parikrama, I have to be with them. So everybody will ask them to be in class. Then not to tell everybody, everybody will listen. listen. Then how will we work? And everybody have Guru Dev give class, have to learn this slok and have to speak about these topics then nothing will take if everyone will speak then who will listen i only listen not speak <coughs> we have one old devotee in mathura named prem Vallabh. <coughs> gurudev was giving class the symptom of vaisnavas konishtadhikari madhyamadhikari and uttamadhikari who sometimes chant hare krishna he is Kanishtha and who is chant always Harinam, he is Madham. Seeing upon whom Harinam manifests automatic in our heart is Uttam. That Premola is telling, Oh Gurudev, even I am chanting, sing not my forget, chant, chant the Holy Lamb. What kind of Bhajna is it? <laughs> He's asking that even I am chanting, sing Narottam, I became so scared, I forgot to chant the whole name. I have run from here. So what kind of Bhajna is it? <laughs> and he has very fair skin. And any outsider will come, we have to take them darshan. If we will go alone, then Panda will abuse disturb them and Narottam, he learned Hindi and all slang language from Pandas. He'll go and tell, I am grandson of our Panda, who do you know who am I? And he was so abused, abused them, all became very scared, oh, he's grandson of Bada Panda, Jamuna Prasad, no one is telling anything to him. Even any Yatri will come, will send with him, so no problem. So yesterday we are discussing about the glory of Navadip Dham, 
आराधितो नवबनम ब्रज काननम ते नाराधितो नवबनम ब्रज एव दूरे आराधित दिजसुत ब्रज नागरस्ते नाराधित दिजसुत न तबेह कृष्ण इन दिस कॉन्टेक्स्ट वी आर डिस्कसिंग दैट ब्रज नागरस्ते इफ समवन हैज टेकन शेल्टर ऑफ श्री चैतन्य महाप्रभु कृष्ण विल बी देयर नागर so what is the definition of nagar we are discussing about this who is nagar so to know the nagar we have discussed in broad to sar krishna two ways on mukharas and the gaunaras mukharas divided into five santa dasa sukha vatsalya madhur and secondary ras divided into hasa करुण रौद्र भयानक वीर विभत्स हास्य अद्भुत करुण रौद्र भयानक वीर विभत्स सो यू डिस्कस्ड इन ब्रज शांत इन डॉर्मेंट पोजिशन एंड दास इन ब्रज देर इज नो दास ऑफ कृष्ण प्योर दास ऑल दो इन वैकुंठ प्लैनेट्स But Pior Dasa in topmost position in Hanuman in Ajodha. Although there is some servant in Braj, they are not servant of Krishna. They are servant of Nanda Baba. So they are kissing <coughs> Krishna. If Krishna became very naughty, the chest I saw oh, naughty boy. Why are you doing this? Any servant never chastises their master. But in Braj, they are chastising also. Why? Because they are servant of Nanda Baba. They have parental mood for Krishna. That oh Krishna like the son of Nanda Baba, like my son. Even they will carry the letter written by Krishna for Gopis. None can make any doubt. Some sakhas, young age, they wrestle with Krishna, like friends. So amalgamated with. friendly tag now i am coming in sokharas we have given some example from sokharas yesterday in sokharas nobody think krishna is bhagavan they think oh he is son of jasoda ma nanda baba i am son of vishwanu baba kritika maiya is going on so when they have they will go for cow grazing they will wrestle each other and krishna always to to sridam in beginning of playing they make some condition the loser have to carry the winner in one group they divide two group one group leader is baladev prabhu another group leader is krishna And Sridam is Baladev Prabhu's side. Now their match is going on, playing is going on. Krishna group became winner, and Baladev Prabhu's group became loser. Now Krishna ride on the shoulder of Sridam. When somebody ride on shoulder, their feet will hang here and have to carry. this is telling to sidam oh my tattu ghoda oh my pani go faster chalo go go faster more faster more faster sidam have to listen sidam is very silent inside we came angry okay let my turn come then i'll see you also going have to go some distance have to come back again he did so again they are playing now baladev pros group became team became winner krishna team became loser then sidam told i ride up krishna shoulder yes before he died on me so who carried us before they are riding they are rivalry now sidam riding on krishna shoulder sidam feet coming here krishna telling sidam telling oh 
Oh my horse. <coughs> Go ahead. Go fast. Faster. More faster. And Krishna holding Siddham's feet and fast, going faster. After that, going some distance, took his feet and put down back and ran away. <laughs> Siddham could not understand why holding his feet. Like Krishna is showing, he is going running faster, holding him. <laughs> Drop him, run away. Siddham told, Sale, what? I carried you, now you drop me. You have to start again from the beginning point. Krishna said, oh my goodness, Siddha will beat me today. Krishna thought, only if I go to Dao Bhaiya, then he can save me. Otherwise, Siddha will beat me very bitterly. Siddha, when you drop all of a sudden, so you have to take some seconds to stood up. Siddha stood up. Clean his dust, then took because stick also dropped, took his stick and ran to Krishna. Sale, where you'll go? Did I beat you? Bitterly have to start from again beginning point. You are disqualified. And Krishna going there, grab all of the two. Thou save me, save me. Siddham is running to beat me. And Baladapur's team leader, when he came, Baladapur Siddham. Cool down. Oh, Krishna is my brother. So I don't love, want to listen brother or father. When he, I carried him, then he was not your brother. Now he became your brother. Siddham, I can carry you twice. No, 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 no. no. This black fellow must have to carry me. Well, to cool him down, satisfy him. By this way, they are playing. Another day, they are doing wrestling match. And that day, Siddham grabbed Krishna, like this, put him down, grab very tightly. And Krishna could not move. Chodore, chodore, morire, morire, chodore, chodore. Means, let me free, let me free, I am dying. <laughs> then Siddham let him free. Krishna took his dart off. Breathing. After that, Krishna clapping all alone. <laughs> Sokha's telling, Hey Kana, why you are clapping all alone? What happened? Krishna told, Because I am winner, Siddham is loser. <laughs> what? You are winner, Siddham is loser. Krishna told, Yes. And Sokha's told, You have no sinus at all. We are all eyewitness. How Siddham grab you? He could not move an inch. When he told, let me free, let me free, then Siddham let you free, then you survive. Otherwise, today he was very bad situation. Krishna told, listen. How I became winner? Well, how? Well, when Siddham grabbed me, Siddham was riding on my chest. Siddham's nose was down, I was full flat on the ground, my nose was up. So my nose was up, so I am winner. All became cheater, pretender, <coughs> liar. Lord, don't accuse me. I am not liar. What is true fact? But this is the rule of wrestling match. Yes, this is the rule. Yes, what is in favor of you? Now you are discovering new, new rule. Durvasari <laughs> see, he was sitting little distance. Who is this boy? Is he Supreme Godhead? He is completely telling lie. Bhagavan never tell lie. How come he became Supreme Godhead? I don't think so. Maybe merely a son of Nanda Baba, very, very naughty boy. I have seen by my own eyes, Siddham became a winner and he is loser and he is eating from others, taking remnant from others. How come Bhagavan became like this? Krishna is omniscient. In Braj, his Bhagavan, his omnisciency and bewildered acting together. So Krishna is omniscient. Oh, he has some doubt. 
I have to rule it out. Krishna told Siddham, Hey Siddham, let us go. Baba is sitting there. Baba will not tell lie. You are liar. Siddham told, you are liar. Now we enter Durbasa. He told Baba, please tell I am winner. Siddham is loser. Siddham told Baba, he came to do bhajan in Braj. Be very, very careful. Don't come in the trap of this black fellow. He's externally black, internally black. And if you tell lie, coming in trap of this black fellow, then all your Sukriti will be finished. Ruined everything. Be careful you came to do bhajan. Don't come in the trap of this black fellow. Who are these boys? I never heard so sweet voice in my whole life. Even once I faced Ambarish Maharaj, even I went to Vaikuntha, I talked with Narayan. His voice is sweet though, but not as sweet as them. Who are these boys? Krishna Baba, you could not tell this. Krishna winner, Siddham loser. Siddham told Baba, don't come in the trap of black fellow. What you have seen your own eyes, tell the fact. The Siddham winner, Krishna loser. What to do now? Durbasa trembling. Eyelids not dropping. Face become open. Not eyelid coming. What happened? Nothing to worry. What happened? Then Durvasa is trembling. And Krishna entered his mouth. In a few seconds, Krishna took him so many universes. And somewhere, same pastime was going on. Durvasa seen him inside other Brahman. How come? I am here, I am seeing myself. Another place, same pastime going on. Krishna and Sudama came to Durvasa. Durvasa mouth. Krishna came out and told to Siddham, Hey Siddham, let us go back. This Baba is bogus Baba. He knows nothing. Baba, you cannot say I am winner. Siddham told Baba, you cannot say I am winner. He told Siddham, that why came to this bogus Baba? Long, long beard. Krishna grab his beard. Baba, are you dead? Could not listen. Pulling his beard and pulling his matted lock. After the Siddham told, Baba, are you dumb? Could not speak. Dumb. Pulling his matted lock and beard. One after another, they sat very tightly. Went away from there. That Krishna is saying Bhagavan in Braj, they never care. Now this is Sakharas. Now I am coming in Batsalaras. Batsalaras divided into two. Parental mood and maternal mood. Paternal and maternal. Mother has more love, deep love than father. Why? Mother carried baby inside her womb. Giving breast milk. Notice there is so many ways. <coughs> First, the baby learned from mother, then from mother's father and other. So it's called mother tongue. Never call father tongue. Raghunath could don't think I am taking side of Manju Didi. So, mother tongue. So, now Krishna, little bigger now, can know how to run one day one in Mathura one lady heard that son of Jata is extremely beautiful how he knew so many are coming broad to sell that fruits this and that she knew so he thought I must take darshan so he's holding one basket putting so many fruits Coming Gokul, to come Gokul have to take a cross Jamuna, telling mango lo, guava lo, banana lo, grapes lo, 
orange low, tangerine low, always calling out. Sometime Krishna, sitting on the lap of Mother Jasoda, sometime lap of Mother Rohini, sometime playing with others' boys. So, she could not take darshan. One day he decided, do or die. She decided, do or die, karenge ya marenge. I'll take darshan of Krishna, otherwise I'll give up my life. So she came. First he was telling mango lo, guava lo, banana lo, then she forgot. Krishna lo, Govind lo, Damodar lo, Madhav lo, Samsundar lo. Now calling Krishna, Krishna you can come and take. And Krishna's promise, Krishna where he stays, where he lives. One Naradrishi went to Vaikuntha. Bhagavan was not there. Vaikuntha means Vaikuntha innermost section is Braj Vrindavan. Ajadha, Dwaraka, Mathura, Braj inside Vaikuntha. So when Naradji could not find, went to Ashram of Jogis. Maybe he is there, not find. Later on one day, Naradrishi met with Krishna, Oh Prabhu, why do you live? Where do you live? I went to Vaikuntha Jogi Ashram. I could not find you. Krishna is telling, Nahang Tishthami Vaikunthe. Shaking his hand. No, no, no. I not live in Vaikuntha. Prabhu, where? Jogi Ashram, shaking his head and hand. Yogi Nam Hridaye Nacha. Not even the heart of Jogis. Prabhu, then where do you live? Madhavakta Jatra Gayanti Tatra Tishthami Narad O Narad, I had my devotee glorifying my name, I am always there. So here the fruit seller lady now glorifying his name. How Krishna can be far away from her? So Krishna, small boy know how to only walk. Yes, golden ankle bell, bangle here, golden waist bell and mother puts small cloth here. Is that somebody calling me to take fruit? I have to trade with her, have to give something. So Krishna enter, Nanda was go down. So much grains. Krishna took, don't know even how to hold it, all going down. Oh my goodness. Then he took and hold against his belly. Like this way. Only he hold few grains. Then he came and gave in the basket of the fruit seller lady. Faldo, Faldo, give me fruit, give me fruit. Seeing Krishna's beautiful form, that lady became stunned. Oh, so beautiful. What to do? Ladies, Faldo, Faldo. It is mentioned in the scripture, Jejan Krishna Bhaje Sevara Chatur. Whoever doing bhajan of Krishna, they are extremely clever. Krishna can cheat everyone in this world. Even devotee can cheat Krishna. Capture Krishna in their heart. So lady told, this is my golden chance. It will know. You have to sit on my lap and have to call me mother. Then I can only give you fruits. You are thinking, oh my goodness. I have my mother, Jasoda, mother, Rohini, so many mothers, how I can call this unknown lady mother? She is saying, no, you must have to take seat on my lap, I have to call me mother. She is now embarrassed, what shall I do now? And seeing the nice fruit, saliva dropping from Krishna's mouth, one and you want to grade the fruits, and on the other hand, don't like to call her mother, don't like to sit. Lady, fruit, give me fruit, give me fruit. Faldo, Faldo. 
little mm -hmm, no he had to sit on my lap and had to call me mother if i call her mother and took seat on her lap if mother jasoda rohini adar will see what they will think this will look here and there anybody is watching me or not no no and then like a thunderbolt flash for a second same way krishna sit on her lap and mother stood up immediately give me fruit <laughs> and krishna hold like this and she gave so many fruits krishna came dancing and gave on the lap of mother jasoda could not speak everything properly all even mother told lala from where are you brought this fruit oh, 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 oh. <laughs> i brought from outside that side could not speak who gave mother just not taking attention he start distributing she is distributing always mother just was courtia full of gopis but there is no lack of fruits she is distributing same amount is there why same amount i am explaining after telling this why same amount i will tell this so what happened fruits is so sweet so sweet then lady is not gone lady sitting there now sun is going to set one braj gopi came and told hey what are you doing you not go back your home then she come in external sense <laughs> due to practice due to his habit he took basket and come when he came on the bank of jamuna now she will have to take a cross now she in external sense how come my basket is so heavy today when she took down she saw so many gems diamond so much gold what shall i do he took the basket and threw in the jamuna after the hari she gone nobody knows so gurudev told because she has desire to serve krishna like mother so in her next birth she took birth in prakot braj her krishna's past time going on and became neighbor of mother jasoda and nourishing krishna like her own baby this is example of bab sallaras so now i'm giving a, why mother jasoda distributing food is always complete before this in february i was in auckland february or Ma yes february march i was we are in auckland new zealand we are listening hari one, one tape of silo bhakti dan sami maharaj in a gurukul in a school teacher teaching them now teachers birthday has come no ritual ceremony of his father father so teacher asking all boys who want to help how, how which way so the low i arrange for puri some to like give sweet this and that one boy was very poor teacher asked how we can serve for my father ritual ceremony so i don't know i have to ask my mother okay then when he came back after school time to so mother all of my friend helping for my teachers ritual father's ritual ceremony teacher asked me what shall i donate mother told son we are very very poor we have nothing so you can ask your madhusudan dada your elder brother why he lives he lives in forest that boy have to always back and forth through the forest you can ask him what will tell you can tell to your teacher next day morning when you are passing through the forest oh madhusudan dada madhusudan dada krishna came in form of this guy is a boy little elder than him 
You are Madhusudan Dada? Yes, I am Madhusudan. What do you want? My teacher's father ritual ceremony coming. All are donating. So teacher asked me, what shall I donate? My mother told me, I have to ask you. Then he told, now you can tell your teacher how much yogurt needed, he will give. Okay. He told, how much yogurt needed? For hundreds of people, I will give. Okay. No problem. All are very happy. Now, two days later, it came. <coughs> and he gave one pot of, clay pot of yogurt. Like you have seen Navadip. Who has been traveled Navadip? So sweet yogurt. When they re remind it, it saliva will come down from mouth. Manjit is very happy. Yes, he is <laughs> remembering. He remembers also, yes. <laughs> so, one full pot of yogurt and hand over to teacher. Teacher became very, what? I invited hundreds of my guests and friends and relatives. Only one pot of yogurt. Became very angry and it dropped. Now more danger. Why you told us before they will give? Well, yes, my Madhusudan has given this. This is enough for everyone. Enough for everyone? Only few person will finish this. When he dropped, yogurt dropped on the floor. Then he took the pot. Again, yogurt is full. Teacher, think, how come? When he dropped, almost all yogurt became finished. Still complete. Then they start distributing. The distributing, there is no end. Taking one big spoon, giving, again one to take, again full, again giving, again full. All became surprise. Then after this feast finish, who is your Madhusudan Dada? Where he lives? He lives in forest. He gave this. What is the Siddhanta here? We have heard from Srila Gurudev and Srila Bhakti and Sami Maharaj. My spiritual grandson had told that Krishna and his ingredients no different. Krishna has given. So Krishna is complete. What he giving is complete. Again is complete. Like infinitive minus infinitive is equal to infinitive. Who know about mathematics? If there is an infinitive number any number infinitive taken is still will be infinity. It mentioned in Veda, Om Puruna Madha Puruna Midam Puruna Puruna Mudha Chate Puruna Sampurna Madhaya Puruna Mabhava Sishate Krishna is complete. So many incarnations coming from Krishna. Who is coming? They are complete. Still Krishna is complete. So Krishna given the yogurt, so it is complete. No end. Now I am giving another example. So what happened? Krishna is fond of stealing butter. They are always telling to Krishna, complaining to Mother Jasoda about Krishna. Mother told, oh, so key. Can you feed little butter to my son? What harm? Will not be lack of your house. So much butter. Then they are telling, oh, Joshua, you don't know. If you want to feed him, he told, do you think I am son of a poor guy? My father and mother has nine lakhs of cows. If you want, my mother can donate as much as you want. I not came to eat from your house. Well, he will tell, give lecture and always still. Mother, and when he come to mother, Krishna is so calm and quiet. Mother is never believe that Krishna even can open one ripe banana. So simple, knows nothing. So mother just never doubt. So they told, okay, you can cut him red-handed. Okay. One day Krishna was stealing butter. One mother caught him red-handed and bind him like there are so many pillars in big big house 
in Braj, Nandava was a royal palace was made of 84 of pillars mm. and all pillars made of gem, not by concrete. And wall made of bricks, but the bricks made of golden bricks, not clay bricks. So one lady caught him red-handed. Oh, your mother never believed. So she brought one rope and bind Krishna with the pillar. Then she went to run to Jasoda's house, close by. Oh, Jasode, oh, Jasode. Jasoda was telling, why is screaming so much? And he holds Jasoda, no, you have to come my house. I want to show something. Mother told, why I go to your house? No, you must have to come. You never believe. Your son is so naughty. Today I want to show you something. Mother just will come and she is dragging. No, you must have to come. Mother just told, oh, Sokhi, don't be angry. Please come in my house. Why I'll go to your inside your house? For a second you can come. Then I'll go with you. So she came. So Krishna is eating there. Mother Jasoda is feeding, so so he called, so Mother Jasoda came. Oh, so Krishna is eating there. Oh my goodness, what happened? I bind him, he's eating. Krishna told, Oh Mother, what happened? How you came? He told, I am not, she told, I am not your mother, I am your aunt, auntie, Kaki. Oh, no problem, oh auntie. How you came? You want something? Then I can ask my mother to donate you. Krishna teasing again and again. Jasnama not understanding why Krishna is telling this. She came. When she came, she saw Krishna is still there. How she bind Krishna with a pillar? Krishna's hand is just binding. Butter is smeared here. All face. And she is Krishna is standing. Oh my goodness. She could not understand, spinning his head, her head, and sit there. How come? Krishna has inconceivable potency. Krishna showed her, same time I am eating there, same time I am bind here. Yogis cannot do this, only Krishna can do this. So none can caught him red handed. And when they complain, mother told, okay, you can caught him red-handed. He said, oh, mother, want, they will caught me red-handed. I will be very calm and quiet, very polite, loyal son of my mother. So one day, Krishna was stealing butter. Dada shook his. Hey, Kana, what are you doing? Why your hand is in a butter pot? Mother? My hand in your butter pot? Oh, oh, you know nothing. You don't know what is this? Oh, actually you know. Oh, my hand was burning so much. Why to make my hand cool? Your hand was burning? How come? You are told? My mother put me bangles. My body is super soft, so fragile, so delicate. Top of that, my mother put bangles and they are jammed so many. So it is so burning sensation. So I was raising cows, I had to go. My house is a little distant, so I came to us, make my hand cool. Then Krishna smile and they smile and run away. Another day, Krishna was stealing butter and the mother Gopi caught him red handed. Oh, Kana, what are you doing? I am doing nothing. You doing nothing? No. Then why your hand inside my butter pot? Really? Oh, you are so innocent. You know, don't know if your hand is inside my butter pot? Oh, mother, actually, I am searching my cup. I lost up my cup. Mother, you know, in Braj, the cop and monkeys are so naughty, so naughty, you cannot believe. 
then mother gopi other there do you think your cup jamun is in butter pot it may be i saw the my cup was running very fast i followed i came to you i have seen the cup enter your house he said that i cannot eat this butter so i have to dilute it it must be sour hey can i have your cup mother i told already the monkey and cup of bridge is very very naughty nil krishna rolling oh bhayar oh i want to catch but is running after that is now put a son look this is my cup and he so told bhayar you have to look this is my cup <laughs> your cup is very hard to catch them how how the cup came nandava giving bought the present the marble toy and kisa so then they began to smile and said on it so none can catch him in red handed by this way krishna doing this and they are releasing bhakt sallagas so by this way krishna make all brajavas is very happy and doing so many notorious past time and tomorrow we'll discuss more past time and how krishna became nagar brajanagaraste we'll discuss tomorrow hare krishna bancha kalpataru bhascha kripa sindhu bhaye bacha patitanang pavane bho krishna ve bho namo namo anybody ask question can ask any question can mention any doubts please speak out and on the name of that girl sandra to suchitra today yeah can i you can do announce her name everybody know yeah come alright we have another question stand up suchitra sandra she is suchitra devi dasi suchitra devi dasi anybody has any question please mention a doubt please speak out yes you mentioned that two was a morning he was uh having the confrontation with uh krishna and sri dam folks i think in the wrestling match so he could not see the rajya lila could not see he was not aware of the lila in raj to was a situation but in some other parts he did not uh, see uh, the things in rajya like uh, draupadi was there and uh, she was having this wonderful pot that she was got from torva sadhu what a question this question Last time of the Pandavas in Kamyavan, where Draupadi had the pot and feeding everyone, but then Durvasa was sent by Duryodhan. And this time, when Durvasa was in Braj, he saw Sri Dham and Krishna wrestling, and he was witnessing all the past times. And he was so amazed at that time when he was in Braj in Kamyavan with Pandavas. He could not understand. the past times of sri krishna that they were taking When place in braj durvasa was in braj and see the past time of braj of krishna and brajavasis here krishna want to show the glory of his devotees how draupadi is one pointed devoted to krishna whenever she call krishna will come like durjodhan want to disrupt her then she called he gobind rakh sharan ab to jivan hari he gobind rakh sharan ab to jivan hari when she call out krishna came in form of garment 
Dushasan had 10,000 elephant power, same strength in his body. Duryodhan became, sorry, Dushasan became completely tired. There is not end of government. And here, when Durvasa came, oh, Maharaj Yudhishthira have to feed me with my 60,000 dis devotees, disciples. He said, okay, no problem. Well, okay, I'm going to take a bath, I'm coming back. Then Yudhishthira called his brothers. Brother told, we cannot do anything. If Draupadi will call Krishna, then Krishna will come. Draupadi called him and Krishna came. And coming, he is telling, Oh, Sakhi, I am very hungry. Feed me something. Feed me something. Draupadi told, I am in danger. Are you making double danger? If somebody has some wound and if you sprinkle some salt or chili powder, how will be more burning? So I am in danger. Are you putting in more danger? Oh, Draupadi, I don't want to listen to anything. Feed me something. But no. I have already eaten and I have cleaned my pot, keep downside up, bring your pot. Krishna found little spinach and cook and drink water, told satisfied. Tasmin to stay jagat to stam prinite prinitam jagat. Krishna satisfied, whole world satisfied. Then Krishna told Bhim, oh, go and call Durvasa now. Bhim was saying, no, 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 don't go like this. Take your club. Take club one side and do your mustas. Sometimes him doing his mustas by left hand and right hand club holding club. Again, left hand holding club. This. Oh, receiver, oh, receiver, come here. Prasad is ready. Oh, my goodness. Prasad ready. Bhim is coming. Oh. Bhim's club will crack our head. Who has which position by the mystic power to they jump through sky, down in the water, they run away. When Bhim arrived there, no one is there. So Krishna wants to show how his devotee is so great than even Durva Sarishi. As before Krishna showed in Sattaju with Ambarish Maharaj, now he showed with Pandavas. Krishna always taking side of his devotee because Krishna is Bhakta Vatsal. To show this, he did this past time to Durvasa. And Durvasa also increasing the glory of devotee, devotion and Bhagavan. So for this reason it happened. When he was in Braj, he became a little bewildered. Is Bhagavan or not? How he can tell, him, how he can tell lie? He tells lie. I have seen my own eyes. So then the Krishna became merciful and so this so many first time. Any other question? So Durvasa, he willingly agreed Durvasa, to play this. Yeah, playing the role to show the greatness of devotee, devotion and Bhagavan. He is not an ordinary person, his incarnation or manifestation of Sivji. When, why Durvasa came to Pandavas in Kamabhan? One day, Ambar, sorry, Durvasa came with his disciple and Durjodhan feed him so nicely. And Rishi asked, Oh, Durjodhan, ask any benediction. He went to know, I don't want any benediction, I serve you for your satisfaction. No, 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 you must have to ask any benediction. He told, Oh, we are here in royal palace, but my cousin brother, they are suffering so much, my heart is breaking. So you must one day be their guest, but after three o'clock. Duryodhan thought, I am very clever. If Duryodhan will, sorry, Duryodhan sending Durvasa Rishi, Duryodhan thought if Durvasa will go, they could not feed. Draupadi had one pot gifted by sun god. When sun will rise, then she can cook, she can feed the innumerable universes, no end. But when she will eat herself, 
Clean the pot, keep upside down, that they could not do anymore again next day after sunrise. So whole world knew this. So Duryodhan made conspiracy in his mind that if Durvasa will go, they could not feed, the Durvasa cast them, they will die. They will never come back to claim the kingdom. This is his inner mood. But so he Rishi, oh, my cousin brother suffering so many ways. We are taking so much night food stuff. They are only maintain their life with forest spinach and some root and fruit. My heart is breaking. He is cheating Durvasa. Durvasa thought, okay. Then Durvasa knows nothing. He went, so after three o'clock, and Krishna is severe. Durvasa showed the whole world how Krishna saved his devotee. By this way, they said Krishna saved them because Krishna is Bhakta Bhatsam. Other question? Maharaj, Durvasa is a great sage, so how can he be cheated like this by Durvasa? He must know. He understood what is his Durvasa's inner mood. Why telling go to after 3 or 3 p.m.? And said, okay, I'll go and show the glory of devotee. So he did. Dear sister and brother, son or daughter, any question other? Okay, then Arati. <coughs> Bitte die Kopfhörer. Uh,